Hi everyone, um, our today presentation will be on medicines affecting the cardiovascular system. Hi, I'm Ali and I'm a pharmacist, medical writer and trainer. This topic, uh, today presentation will focus on the impact of medications on the cardiovascular system. Introductions and key points about the cardiovascular system and related conditions. Here are some important things to know about the cardiovascular system and how it can be affected by medications and health conditions. The cardiovascular system is made up of the heart and blood vessels which work together to distribute oxygen and nutrients throughout the body while also removing waste products. Medications that affect the cardiovascular system are among the most commonly prescribed in medicines. Hypertension is a condition in which blood pressure is abnormally high, potentially leading to damage to the blood vessels and increasing the risk of heart attack, stroke and kidney failure. Angina is a type of chest pain that occurs when the heart is not receiving enough oxygen-rich food, often due to blockage or tearing of the coronary arteries. Uh, here are the few points uh, regarding the heart conditions, arrhythmias. Arrhythmias refer to the irregular heart rhythms that can hinder the heart efficiency and safety of pumping action. Heart failure occurs when the heart is unable to pump enough blood to meet the body's requirements, resulting in symptoms such as weak shortness of breath and swelling. Type of drugs that affect the cardiovascular system in inotropes are the drugs that can either increase positive inotropes or decrease negative inotropes. The strength of the heart contraction. Positive inotropes are like digoxin, dopamine, and dopamine and aminorenone are useful in treating heart failures and cardiogenic shock, which occur when the heart cannot pump enough blood. Negative inotropes such as beta blockers, calcium channel blockers and nitrates are used to treat angina and hypertension which happen when the heart is working too hard and needs to reduce its oxygen demand. Type of drugs that affect the cardiovascular system. The drugs that affect the heart rate are called gonotropes. They can either increase or decrease the frequency of the heartbeat. Positive gonotropes are used to treat bradycardia, slow heart rate while negative chronotropes are used to treat tachycardia fast heart rate. Positive chronotropes include atropine, uh, epinephrine, and isoproteinol. Negative chronotropes include beta blockers, calcium channel, channel blockers, and redoxin. These, uh, the drugs that affect the blood vessel stone are called as use dilators, they can either relax or constrict the smooth muscle in the wall of the blood vessels. Use dilators, and these are the medications used to treat hypertension, angina, and heart failure by whitening, uh, narrowing, or stiff blood vessels that impede blood flow. Nitrates, calcium channel blockers, ACE inhibitors, PRBs, and high Lazine are examples of vasodilators. Vasoconstrictors, they are medications used to treat hypertension, shock, and hemorrhaging spike, constricting overly dilated or weak blood vessels, which ultimately increase blood pressure and perfusion. Examples of vasoconstrictors include epinephrine, norepinephrine, dopamine, phenyl epinephrine, and vasopressin. Contrarian. Here are some key points about the impact, risk, and advancements in cardiovascular drugs. Cardiovascular drugs are crucial for enhancing the quality of life and survival of individuals with cardiac issues. Despite their benefits, these drugs come with potential risk and limitations, including resistance, infection, adverse effects, and compliance issues. It is uh, essential to use these drugs uh, judiciously and monitor their effect closely while exploring new improved alternatives. Some of the latest trends and innovations in cardiovascular drugs include gene therapy, stem cells therapy, nanomedicines, and personalized medicine. You can contact me on my number 9230053419060 and my email address is here ali.denon at the rate of gmail.com. Thank you very much. 
see you next time. Take care. Bye.